to work with Stain, Division 4 in the West so Conference. Uh, Division 4? Yeah. This one's been held up a couple so of times. So here you that, go. So we are sitting at three eleven here, so this has been this one's obviously been a, a little bit of a a slow burner this, so this, far. Hopefully, it'll put, hopefully this it'll one pick is up also a in bit. a couple of different it's a couple of different time zones as well, which doesn't really help. Oh yeah, the time zones is a big thing as yeah. well. It's obviously it is, and, and I get that. Got, you know, the time zones is a huge thing. But check your phone. Check your phone. Yeah, you got well. Everyone's on the phone all the, the time now. Check your phone. The first picks in America. I'm pretty sure the. 11th pick is and McCaffrey in the same team. That's just that the that's great, you know. It's uh, but I think mm-hmm. and McCaffrey in the same team is almost cheating if you ask me, do you know what I mean? <laughs> and you got uh, Adam uh, yeah. Brown, McBride, and Andrews in the 105. Sean, what are you doing to me? Sean started so well. Flemboats, Holland Gibbs, what a fantastic start! And then he went and picked up Mahomes in the sub. I know that that's was a bad bad package. Package. It's not a bad pack. It's just well early. I know, but I, I would probably have picked Jackson over Mahomes just for the run inside if I was going to pick a quarterback. 100%. But yeah, because Mahomes. I, I, listen, I'll have Richardson over Mahomes. I'll have Richardson before Mahomes this year. I'll have. Uh, yeah, I'd have Richardson before Mahomes this year. Yeah. But yeah, so. Alan and McCaffrey. Yeah, Alan and McCaffrey's cheat code. Uh, two tight ends, tight here. Yeah, Michael got yep. Chase, one of four, Kieran Williams, and Pacheco in the three point four. That's a nice little start, too. I've got to say, I like what Jack's done here. And if you know, with, it, with, with Laporte and Kelsey, one and two, yeah. I'm interested to then see Jackson. where that one goes now. And Jackson is a running, I mean, he literally doesn't have a running back, doesn't have a wide receiver, and he's going into round four. I'm very interested to see, and I like to see that, see people doing it differently, you know, to see how it comes out. Very interested to see how this one comes out with no running back or wide receiver on the first three rounds. And, and obviously, uh, Chris and the one who always started off with Pukaniku and Nico Collins, which isn't a bad two to start. But... Yeah, I, see for, I, I, just, I think I just but cannot I think see how. Be better. So yeah, I can't see how Puka does what he done last year. And don't get me wrong, I don't think he's going to be awful. I don't think he's going to be terrible or anything like that. I just cannot see how he's going to repeat last year. And as I, I agree with you, Johnny, I think Cup's going to come back and and, and take over as the number one again. So yeah, Puka yeah. in the first round, not for me. No. It's... Yeah. So, no, I actually so, yeah, like what uh, Michael's done here. What Michael's done here, Amo, you know, he's picked up Chase at 104, which is, you know, if you want yeah. him, you got to take him early. Uh, I love Kyron Williams and getting him at 209 is, is, I know that he's much further down the list in sleeper than in this, and in, in the, the, you know, the way that the players are last, he's way down, but he shouldn't be. Yeah. And then Pacheco, Pacheco in the, in the, in the third, third round. So, yeah, I don't, I don't hate what Michael's done. Oh, Scott started off with CD Lamb, Trevor Setien, and A-Chain. Obviously, A-Chain have had big games, but for the most part, yeah. A-Chain Nick is Tassel, that one again, isn't A-Chain, for me, Please. he has... He he's he's got so much speed. If he can stay fat, he's a Richardson. If if Chain can stay fat, he could win him the 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 league. You know, he, he could certainly get him promoted. Yeah, well, that's that, he is that good. Lamb, if Lamb plays like last year, Chain stays fit. He's got the base of a bloody strong massive. Team. Ma- yeah, but staying uh, healthy is uh, a problem, uh, and obviously they've got Jalen Wright signed as well. He's another fast little bugger. And obviously, most of who's defying age by still playing hard and strong. Well, so that, that Miami it, backfield was a bit. Oof. But it's a tough one. Well, I mean, it, it, there's too many of them now, isn't it? Who, who, you, who are you going to give it to? But I, I do, as I say, I think if A chain stays fat, he's going to get a lot. Yeah, there's, a, there's a message for you, Craig. Enjoy, enjoy the rest of your work, Everett. Cheers. <laughs> He's only got an hour right. to go, so it's not too bad. At this rate, it might still be on anyway, like, but yeah. Yeah, so we'll definitely get you yeah, on again, Everett. Lads yeah. is, uh, Ads is doing the same as Jack here in the sense that, oh no, he has, he's got one wide receiver, he's got uh, St. Brown there, but yeah, McBride and Andrews. 
interesting to see where it goes, as I say. And I, I've got no problem with taking two of the premium tight ends, not only because, you know, you can play them in your flex, you get an extra half point per catch and such, not only because you can play the two of them, but because you're taking them off of other people and there are only so many tight ends who really do score week on week on week on week. So grabbing up two of them and keeping them away mm-hmm. from other people, it could be a winning strategy. I'm interested to see. Well, obviously you can because there's is it three flex spots. I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah, yeah, you, and you play them in the flex. Yeah, so I mean, you, you can yeah, play two them. Flex spots. Yeah. You can absolutely play them both, but it's 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 leaving the dregs for your opponents, which I don't hate. Because after kind of, I yeah. think there's maybe like twelve tight ends, and then after that, it's yeah, all much of a muchness, even in Danny. Yeah, we've not got all much of a yet, muchness, Danny, right, you know. So. I know. So, but then, uh, once yeah. starting the bar, Barkley and Taylor, obviously Barkley in the first is a bit. Yeah, still two good running backs, but oh, well, he's only got three of them. Yeah. Um, yes, yes, yes. I, I mean, again, I don't hate it. I, I, I'm not a big. But Barkley's what one, two, three, four, four. Gibbs, I would have Gibbs before Barkley. You know, it's I'm, yeah, I guess not too many. And Taylor maybe as well, you know, but it's, oh, it's one of those ones. I'm just so on the fence with Barclay. I can't make my mind up about him at all. But yes, it, it, could, it could be an absolute... In fact, if you look at that, Johnny, do you not recognise that backfield of Barclay and Taylor? I think you'll find that was my Show Me The Money backfield all year last year. Yeah, the one that didn't win yet. Yeah. Well, I've got it. I've, I've got I've got that uh, big issue now um, to keep to keep or not to them? keep. But yeah. I don't know. I do, I think. Don't know yeah, it's got 18 there yeah. as well. But we shall see. But yeah, so, Arch, uh, yeah, I, I do like the start. I, I like the back-back start, you know, I do. It's, uh, I like the start there from Nick Tactics as well, what Jefferson, Wilson and, and Kincaid. Kincaid, yeah, that is a good one, Nick. But It's certainly the three number one targets in, in, their, t- in, in their various teams by a country mile, you know. Yeah, so well, it's a tough one because it's so early, but next there's probably three or four here that I really like. So I can't, I can't. Pick yeah, I mean, them. I don't hate, I don't, I don't dislike any of them. And oh, there yeah, we go, Pittman has just been Pittman. picked by. I just messaged them when the three of us left. So, so get Bartley yeah. Taylor and Pittman, Bartley Taylor, and added to that Pittman, and Pittman could be, but I get Pittman. The issue with Pittman is what say uh, Richardson going to be like throwing the ball. And will he stay fat? But uh, this one, I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see how the double tight ends go from here. That's what I'm taking from this one so far. Yeah, and I don't hear it. And I've got a pick in two picks time, and might just fall short because I'm actually quite liking it. <laughs> but we'll see. Well, yeah, oh, yeah, because you've got your trade so you've got. Yeah, I've got three or seven as well. I'll be three picks. Yeah, two, two and then me. Sean, then yeah, so obviously only two and then me. near 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 the end of the third round here, but they did they were the last ones to finish the first round, but then they fairly shot through a bit. So hopefully they're on a bit of a roll. Hopefully Chris is still about hopefully to pick pack up. Yeah, I've I mean just, that, that that's that's missing. Around a day is a three-week draft. Let's not forget that. Around a day, this draft will be going for three weeks. So we'll start. We'll go on to the East Conference. On to the East. So here come the East Superstars. The Superstars of the East. The Defending Champions started with 103. So you started off with Tyreek Hill, Derek Henry, Pittman, DJ Moore and Lamar Jackson, the 503. I mean, Lamar is not... It's not a disaster. I cannot believe that Caleb Williams has went before Lamar. I don't know. It was a bit of a shock. But, um, what can you say? Yeah, that, it's a good good start for Danny there. Eh? It's uh, defend. You say defending champ. It's uh, mm-hmm. a nervous draft. I would imagine. You know, it's, it must be difficult coming into the. You know, you. It's not just like you've not just beat eleven guys last year or fifteen guys or however many your league is. You know, you beat ninety five guys last year, Danny. Ninety five guys have got a target on your back. <laughs> Yeah, I I don't think I would have let Lamar go past the fifth either. And I know I don't do quarterbacks early, but, you know, if he's sitting there in the fifth, 
I would have pulled the trigger as well, probably. So Jack's, Jack's gone for the older crew. You've got uh, McCaffrey, Adams, Andrews, Metcalf and Cup from the 101. Yeah, I mean, Metcalf's mm. not that old, let's not forget. Metcalf's still only mid-twenties, is he not? Yes, Aaron, you're, you're Yeah, your league's done, done Aaron. We looked at yours. You're doing okay. You're doing well. You're all right. Apart from your last pick, I can't remember who it was now, but your last one was crap. <laughs> but yeah, Jackson's <laughs> gone for the old crew as well. A little bit there, Adams and Cup and such. Adams, I, I just can't be on board with Adams at all. I've got my 17 on, but not for me this year. Who's thrown to him? Yeah. That in front problem. of who's thrown to him's not very good. And, oh, yeah, just Minshew? the Raiders Minshew? are a, a mess at the moment. Yeah, I like Do you know the best like thing the... that can happen for everyone who picks up Adams in the second, third round where he's going at the moment? The best thing that could happen to him is get traded. Yeah, well, that, that rumour is always going about, but I don't know if anybody will pay a lot for him. So. You got, I, I like Graham's, Jamar Chase, Travis Kelsey, Hurts, Kamara, and Nixon. Nixon, not Nixon. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, getting Hurts in the third, I guess it's. Division, not division. Yeah, yeah, well, we'll see. You shut up. <laughs> what, Should, shouldn't hand? you be getting ready to go? I don't know. Go on your holidays. Mm. What we got? Uh, do you know, here's another double, here's another double tight end, Johnny. Double tight end alert. And I, I actually love what this, who's that? Oh, it's, 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 uh, it's SX from Australia. Love yeah. that. That's his, my favourite start I've seen so far. It's a good one for Guy. Jefferson yeah. Williams. Guy's a good player. He's a lot of fans football. But, uh, do you know, I hadn't even contemplated a double tight, double early tight end, but the more I look at these teams, the more I think that ah, double tight end it might work. But then you've got, to, you've got to think, though, obviously, they're going to be feeding Harrison as much as they can. So that might affect McBride. Ingram will still get Maybe. targets. But... Uh, Maybe I I I agree, Johnny. I agree, but at the same time, I think that Murray has shown. You know, it's not like Murray's a new quarterback. He was injured last year. He was in the little start last year. But we'll see what Murray can do. He has proved it year after year after year. He is a top quality quarterback. The question is, can he stay fit? Can that line protect him? And if it does, I think there's that, more that than enough problem. to go about for McBride and. McBride and, uh, and Harrison, you know, because outside of that, you've kind of got Zay Jones, but then you've got your kind of Wilsons and your Dorches and nothing else really there, you know? I think so. Zay Jones always scores points. Can he will get you points. Yeah, and, and, and he's, he, he's a long shot as well, isn't he? And you know Murray can bomb a ball. Murray's got an arm. And Zay oh, Jones is a long arm, ball. Yeah. You know, he's a he's a yard touchdown guy. That's who he is. Yes. So uh, yeah, and oh, we've got double tight end twice here as well. We've got double tight end uh, in eleven as well. We've got Gibbs. Oh, he's got he's got neighbors. Laporta, and neighbors and Kincaid. Laporta and uh, Kincaid. I mean, uh, neighbors could neighbors could be brilliant because who else is going to be getting the ball there? Who else is going to be getting the ball in New York? I mean, neighbors oh, could be. Like Wonder Robinson. Robinson will get the ball high. I'll get the long ball. Slate yeah. might be getting traded, so I, I don't Wendell. mind the neighbours one because neighbours will be the you'll get as many targets as uh, Waller got last year. So try and get him as many targets as he can, as, as much as he can. And the PPR, Wendell Robertson needs to be on the pitch to get a catch. Yeah, so does Hyatt. So does half the Giants team, to be honest. But yeah, exactly. He, 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 you know, he'll get the targets. So that's the thing. If he catches them, you're going to get the points. I mean, yeah, exactly. I mean, he could be very, 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 very good. But for me, drafting him in the third round is you're drafting him at his ceiling. He's not yeah, going to do it. He's not going to be. He's not going to be any better. He's not going to score more than any of the enough. receivers taken in front of him. And he's not going to do better than Evans, Devontae Smith, Cooper Cup. Nico Collins, Debo Samuels, even George Pickens could potentially have a good year. So, yeah, it's, there's a lot of absolutely. good receivers picked after him. But when you've got Gibbs, Laporta and Kincaid, that's a three. Three out of four crack and start. And obviously, I'm a Giants fan and neighbours in the third. Yeah, I mean, it's obviously the first couple of rounds, the first few rounds, 
the first few rounds, you should be drafting people at the ceiling because you should be drafting the absolute superstars, you know. Neighbours, there is a downside. There, there's definitely a floor. You know, there is a floor for neighbours. So you're drafting them at your ceiling there. You know, I'm not a fan of that. Whereas Pickens here, you're picking Pickens up in the fifth round. He's going to be the number one. To, and, and I get that. It's, I mean, Russell Wilson's a good quarterback. And if they, can, if, if they can get the best out of him, and you, you know, uh, the, they've got a history of getting the best out of people at, in Pittsburgh. You know, yeah. Pittsburgh are never terrible. They're not picking him up no. for nothing, you know. And if he, if he is useless, well, we've seen that people... 